For years, Tesla has been working on the development of the world's most powerful supercomputer, the quantum supercomputer which will handle the mass amounts of video data collected by the neural networks of the vehicles. Elon Musk is a modern visionary as he has created many remarkable inventions such as Tesla and SpaceX that are working hard to make the impossible possible in a convenient and cost-efficient way. So without further ado, let's talk about this computer and how it can bring revolutionary changes to our lives. Why does Tesla need such powerful computers? As we know that Tesla uses the neural network algorithm, which uses cameras and radars to pass inputs from its vehicles and help the users to perform semantic segmentation and identification of the objects on the surface while self-driving, the video data collected is so immense since it's collected from eight different cameras that it needs more computational power to initiate self-driving. The neural networks reconstruct a map of the vehicle's surroundings since it doesn't use a LiDAR sensor for determining the ranges of a surface or identifying objects. Handling such massive amounts of data collected needs fast computation, and since Tesla is a company that gets the most video data as compared to other automotive companies, it requires a supercomputer for faster computation. This proposed the need for a faster computer, and Elon Musk took matters into his own hands by developing quantum computing technology. Where one would think of Tesla as nothing more than a vehicle manufacturing company whose only aim is to build battery-powered efficient vehicles, but in reality, Tesla is much more than just an automotive company. It is also a computer-based company. Since it has a league in market capitalization, Tesla makes it to the list of the top market capitalized companies such as Microsoft, Google, Apple, Facebook, and Amazon. In fact, Toyota, the second capitalized automotive company, has only a quarter worth of Tesla. Tesla is also at the top of its game as it adds new and cool features with its over-the-air updates that would automatically update the vehicle's software, just like Microsoft updates the PC and Apple, provides the features to update the software program of an iPhone. Tesla is also leading in developing the best software systems for its vehicles and the best user interface, make it much more convenient for people to interact with the software. This shows how seriously Elon takes the software programs of vehicles as he claimed that his Model S is not a car, but instead a sophisticated computer on wheels. Elon considers Tesla more than just an automotive company. As he says, Tesla is as much a software company as it's a hardware company, both in car and in factory. This is not widely understood. One prime example to put this company's software achievement into words would be the revolutionary software program of self-driving technology using neural nets instead of LiDAR sensors. Though this is a revolutionary technology that its users swear by, it does require a lot of computing power to be able to make a vehicle move autonomously and to solve this issue. Tesla unveiled the near quantum supercomputer that is complex, yet a powerful supercomputer that'll be able to do faster computations while managing vast amounts of data. The aim of this computer was that Tesla needs a super quantum computer for its self-driving technology. And since there was no computer with such power, Elon took matters into his own hands and created the quantum supercomputer. Quantum computers are being built to train neural nets using video data collected from vehicles of Tesla. The quantum computers will have a general purpose design that will make them useful for other industries in terms of deep learning, optimization, simulation, and natural language processing as well. More recently, there have been many countries that have built their own supercomputers, such as Jewel Supercomputer in Germany, Fugaku, the most powerful supercomputer in Japan, Super Taihu Light in China, and the US having four different supercomputers like Summit, Sierra, Perlmutter, and Selene. These computers are capable of managing massive amounts of data while also providing fast computational speeds. And recently, Fugaku has been widely used in fighting COVID-19. The supercomputer developed by Tesla will be able to handle 68.75 petaflops, which is low in terms of other supercomputers mentioned in the list. But since it's built to handle mass video data and train neural nets, no other supercomputer comes closer to quantum supercomputers by Tesla. The near quantum computing by Tesla will make processing faster and train the neural nets. While some companies use the LiDAR sensors to identify objects on the road when self-driving, Tesla focuses more on building a transformer, which is a giant neural network that will use eight cameras at once, which will provide more information when self-driving. Elon is all set to lead from his fellow competitors by swearing on quantum computing for its neural network technology. 
Quantum computers will be powered by the Dojo D1 chip, which will provide the best bandwidth and good computing performance required to train the neural nets that power the AI technology of Tesla. The D1 chip uses a 7 nanometer manufacturing process and is capable of delivering 362 teraflops of processing power at BF16 CFP8 precision. The D1 chip is manufactured in a 7 nanometer process and contains about 50 billion transistors in an area of 645 millimeters square, making it smaller than GA100 GPU that was used in NVIDIA A100, which is about 826 millimeters square. Tesla believes that the Dojo D1 will be able to process four times faster than the current systems in work, which will make the self-driving system of the company more phenomenal and faster. Tesla revealed that the D1 chip will work in a training tile module as each of the D1's 354 chip nodes will have one teraflop of computation. The chips will be housed in a training tile module and each tile will consist of 25 D1 chips where a single tile will provide 9 petaflops of computing with 36 TBPS of bandwidth. The company aims to have a single exapod that will have 10 connected cabinets, whereas a single cabinet will have 2 trays of 6 tiles computing 100 petaflops per cabinet. The exapod will be able to house 120 tiles while having 3,000 D1 chips with 1 million nodes. There is no doubt that the use of quantum supercomputers will reform traditional computational methods as they would be able to process millions of data within seconds and easily manage massive amounts of information. Elon Musk is all set to take his innovations to the next level as he hints at the implementation of quantum supercomputers in the training of neural nets to make his vehicles more advanced as they would be able to map the surface with mirror images instead of using a LiDAR sensor. What's taking so long in the persuasion of quantum supercomputers? Since there are fewer quantum algorithms to work with, it has been a task to match these algorithms with the neural network algorithms, which has been causing a delay in the implementation of the supercomputers. But Elon Musk and the team of Tesla are dedicated to finding solutions for this and use quantum supercomputer technology to handle masses of data and train the neural nets in which the vehicle self-drive depends on. Tesla aims to provide other AI companies its quantum computing as well so that the world can experience revolution altogether. This quantum computer is being developed to handle the massive video data that's used by Tesla's vehicles to work on the neural net technology, as the high-performance computing options were not satisfactory for the vehicles to work on the neural net phenomenon, and this led to the need of creation of quantum computers. Elon Musk also aims to open the use of supercomputers as a web service to train machine learning models for people. And that's it for today. It's no doubt that quantum computers will open the doors to faster and more revolutionary computing. Elon Musk has always shocked the world with his new and innovative inventions, and this near supercomputer system also looks promising as his SpaceX project. Like this video if you found it helpful. We hope you enjoyed today's video. Comment whether you think Elon Musk has a great plan in mind for the future of faster computing and whether this supercomputer will bring change for the better. We will see you guys next time with a brand new video. Till then, take care.